I'm this isn't my fault anymore. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I, we we should have killed the Meta. Can we all agree? We I mean, should have. Yeah, we should have. Sweet. <laughs> Look at what you did, Meta. <laughs> I didn't vote to listen. This is the Meta's think. fault. This isn't my fault. Jackie, it's not a beautiful train wreck. This is actually a really fun script. We've we've run it before, and I've had a. I've had a blast. Uh, but, uh, I think we did this once off stream and we did this once on stream and it was very fun both times. Hey, Maya. Um, Navin, do you have anything about this script that kind of stands out to you? Poisoner. There is some poison, and especially the Poisoner, which I know is your favorite minion, possibly favorite character. Uh, yeah, this actually, this script has a lot of things that I really like. It's got Chambermaid, it's got Fortune Teller, it's got Raven Keeper, it's got Goon. It's got Leech. Hell yeah. Afro, thank you for the Gooseiversary. We appreciate that. Um, I I feel like Goon is one of those roles that very much goes underappreciated a lot of times. And uh, I, I, yeah, it has some of your favorite things, almost like Whiskers on Kittens. How about that? Uh, if, if I pull Philo, you know I'm going Goon, right? Philo Goon? Yeah. Well, you could go... Yeah, you're probably going to go Goon, aren't you? you <laughs> Philo Snake Charmer is also an option. Yeah, but Philo Goon is more fun. It is, yeah. Um, Alright, so why don't we head back up and see what Art has in store for us. Okay. Thank you very much. CB, thank you for the 15 gifted subs. What? That's crazy. Hey, guys. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Good morning. What's well, good? Bonsoir. Bonsoir, indeed. It is Saturday there, right, Bambi? Yes, it's 2 a.m. 2 a.m., you say? 2 a.m.? 2 a.m.? 2 a.m. 2 2 Me? Could we get... Could we get a, a a drink check? What are what are we drinking tonight? Well, I'm... in a after stream, I'm going to be drinking something called the Shrek 2. What's a... Sh you know what? Do I want to know? I mean, you you can ask. I can tell you. I feel like you I'm put the DVD in the glass. Go ahead. What is a Shrek two? Um. So me uh, and my new roommate, whose name is Kim, uh, she's on other streams. She probably met her at Clock Tower Con. Uh, very lovely person. We've decided. <laughs> shut up. We have decided <laughs> to uh, ask Chat GPT. Uh, Okay, we decided to ask ChatGPT to uh, um, make us drink recipes because we want to make mixed drinks and be like bad, uh, you know, bartender things. Um, so we bought a bottle of rum and we asked ChatGPT to make us rum drinks with various like fruits and vegetables and things we have in our and, like peppers that we have in our fridge. And the one that we are going to try tonight is a uh, jalapenos ginger beer rum and simple syrup thing that we have effectually uh named shrek 2 we haven't tried it yet but it's gonna be great okay it is uh, 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 okay jalapenos ginger beer rum simple syrup it's gonna be great shrek 2 is it kim from my little uh, snake shamer yes yes it is it is that kim baby well i am excited kim. to see what the aftermath of that drink is I will I, I will probably be posting this on my TikTok. It will be great. Okay. Uh so as you guys know, uh we have our good friend Art uh here. Uh and Art is always a frequent contributor here, and we always have a great time when Art's here. Um but very much so when Art is doing the storytelling. So uh I could not uh I could not be more happy to play a game with Navian in which we uh, have Art at the helm to put Navian and I against each other and and make us want to kill each other. Hey, that'll be the tool that does that, not me. Mm, okay. But thank you guys for having me and my theatrics. We love them. Um, I will see if I can uh, figure out how to do this. It's been a while. Uh, but I hope you guys have a good game, and I'm going to send you off. Send out some characters, and I'm sure we'll have some conversations. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. I'm very excited to see what I am. Art is very cool, Maya. We're big fans of art here. Be sure to stay hydrated, y'all. Golem? Okay. I could I could dig being a golem. Maybe a psychopath? I don't think I've ever... No, I was a psychopath once. Oh, it's close. I'm a seamstress. I'm a seamstress. Emma and Bilk. Uh, by the way, 
if you guys have not watched the most recent episode of Grim Scenarios, I don't know what you're doing with your lives, but in the most recent episode of Grim Scenarios, uh, Emma was a mathematician where Resnora is sitting, and I was, or, or, and player seven, where I'm seated, was a seamstress. Well, it has a video form as well, CB. So, um, Grim Scenarios is great. Don't Lose is Grim sort for Grames or Grimothy. Okay. All right. Yo, Hype Train. Hype Train. Choo Choo. Uh, do we whisper to Bruce and Rez first uh, to basically simulate being an empath? I mean, I, I, wanna, I want to... Um, I want to use it. I think I want to use it first. Um, there's no Vortox, so I guess I don't have to necessarily, but yeah, we probably should check for, for because of Marionette. Right back, you know that's not going to happen. You bet 6969? Nice, nice. Night 1, Navian and Mully. That's an interesting choice. They are seated next to each other. No, they're not. Pick Navian for sure. Ooh. Knowing what team Navian is playing for is definitely useful. Oh, we don't. We would know what relatively team they're playing. Oh, by the way, just so you know, I never answered my own drink check. We've got some Gatorade. We've got some water. Demeter prevents Malachan whispering night. Yeah, that's never going to happen. Come on. Uh, I actually think it's the best possible choice. Jason Bambi is another good one. Um, we could do Jason Bambi. We could do Res Mal. Um, yeah, I think that's actually not a bad idea, Mara. We should probably maybe wait at least one night because Psycho is on the script. I, I would be very surprised if there was a leech host on us. So then we just go to game two. See, I don't know about that, Ryback. I think it depends on the person. Like, Bambi just might kill Jason. Go to Lake Compounds? NYC, my guy, you've clearly not been to Compounds in a while. It has gone downhill. It has gone downhill bad. Though, to be fair, it's probably only maybe about 15 minutes from where I live. It's... What about Quasi? Um, I, I think the last time I was at Quasi, I was like 12. I haven't been to Quasi in ages. Big new... Big... So, as a shock to no one, I'm actually not a big, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, not a big amusement park kind of guy. Um, my favorite part when I was a kid probably would have been the, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? The, the, like the water park. But as I've gotten older, um, they're disgusting. I, I, I wouldn't go, you couldn't pay me to be near a water park anymore. No. 25 cent Fridays. E yikes. Guys, we're at 47% good. I mean, to be fair, we don't know what team I'm on, to be fair. Put all your money's on good, appreciate it. Hello. Hello, Art. How are you? I'm doing fine. How are you? I'm living my best life. I don't have to story tell. This is great. <laughs> well, it just so happens that you, uh, doing what you do in this town, have gotten quite familiar with the people and the garments that they wear, and so you feel like you have a keen ability to to match two articles of clothing from two separate people together to, to figure out if they have of similar mindsets with their lifestyles. So uh, I've just come by to see if you would like to use your ability or if you want to save that. I am holstering the scissors for the day. Understandable. Well, good luck. Thank you very much. Yeah, don't want to swim in pee. Sorry. Um, we actually had a public park close in the city that I live in. Um... And it was very popular for a lot of people, but it was closed because it was just gross. It was just, it was just gross. So they had to close it. Tore it down, actually. It was in a park. You prefer to swim in pee? Listen, you do you. do you. We don't kink shame here. Wait, is that Emma? Guys, go give Emma and Milk some love. They do an amazing job on Grim Scenarios. Seriously, they do. Hashtag not sponsored, but they do an excellent job. Hi, Milk. You're both here. They are wonderful people. And they put out amazing content. And I highly recommend getting out there and giving it a follow. And uh, seeing all of the great work that they do. Um, yes, Emma and Butt. That is correct. Um, it's a it's a really good podcast. They they do... Um, it, 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 it. Alright, so like... Me. Me. Demeta. I play the game a very specific way. Um, it is not necessarily the most logical way. There are many different ways to play this game. The way that I play this game is not necessarily the most efficient, we'll say. I don't know, maybe you guys have picked up on that over the past two years. Um, 
Milk and Emma really attack the game in a very different way. Good morning. Before I begin uh, a little tale, I would like to remind everyone that there is a sentinel and a spirit of ivory in play. You awaken to the sounds of screaming from the town square. As you make haste to the clock tower, you see the unexpected sight of your storyteller, dead, impaled and bleeding on the clock tower, high up, just below the face of the clock. You can remember your grandparents and great-grandparents telling you the stories of a long-ago birthday feast where something similar happened. Nothing like this has happened in eons in this sleepy little town. Your focus returns to the present and to the scene before you. Though horrifying, the villager does not seem to be screaming about the dead body, but instead is backing away slowly from a large group of cats that appear to be gathering at the clock tower. Among them you see lynx, panthers, tigers, and many other species, some of which you've never seen here in the mountains of Ravenswood Bluff. One cat steps out slowly to the top of the steps, looking around not in a predatory way, but more of a curious one. The remaining cats slowly take to laying down, drifting off into some sort of slumber or idly cleaning themselves, all except the one cat. In a slow motion, the lone feline opens its mouth wide and a yawn before setting, settling with a toothy grin. The next time its mouth opens, it speaks in a slow and confident drawl. My name is Abyssinian Berman. I am the harbinger of the One. The One is an eons old being whose powers are unrivaled. However, through time, they have become bored with this world and is now only amused by games. You have been chosen for the next game. As the Harbinger, I am here to provide you with the rules. There are some among you who have been changed. They are no longer working for this town. They are working for the One. They appear the same to you, but the goals are now different. One among them is the chosen Herald of the One. You must find them and destroy the Herald before the Herald and the others destroy you. Each day you will be given the opportunity to destroy one member of the town. Choose wisely and win. Choose poorly and lose. Or at least eliminate a possibility. And though mine and the fates of all of my friends would be released if you beat the one, we cannot take sides. We will provide you with no aid. We are here, surrounding the town. No one gets in or out until the game is resolved. I will visit you each morning to update you on the game. Good luck. With one last prolonged growl, the other cats majestically stand, and within a few seconds, they are gone, and you are all left to wonder who among you is no longer themselves. I'll give you minutes you are, you're the best you are absolutely amazing. the best big fan big fan yeah i love you both it's amazing hey bruce let's talk let's Hello. chat hey buddy yeah how you doing uh, also gambling thank you 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 all right <laughs> how would you what would you like to do uh ones ones yeah uh should i be honest with you i think you should i have never been honest on a day one. Ooh, first time for everything fine snake charmer snake charmer who'd you check you and uh you obviously turned yep correct yeah because i'm the snake charmer now so that makes sense that makes sense yep um okay uh i'm uh yeah yeah you know what yeah i'm the puzzle master fuck you could be the demon i could just be puzzle drunk <laughs> that's the dream fuck <laughs> uh okay yeah. um yeah, so if you hear of anybody who you think like might have weird information but odd, odds are pretty good that the puzzle master or puzzle drunk is not somebody who would act immediately yeah but out of curiosity, we'll would you would you want to be told if you were my marionette? Out of curiosity, yes. Okay. Would you? You're, I would. Okay. Uh, we'll talk more tomorrow. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Bye. Hey, shall we chat? We. Oh, 
Where's Nora? Navy in the ship. Sure. Uh, Malibok. Let's lie to each other. Sure. Hello. Greetings. How are you? T how are you today? I'm doing good. How are you? Uh, I'm living my best life. Um, what would you like to do? Uh, I will tell you that my role has not acted yet. I will tell you that my role has not acted yet either. Okay, I will tell you that my role can act tomorrow night. I will tell you that my role acts at some point. As in, it didn't act tonight, or last night, but it could act tonight. I just don't know if it's going to or not. It's you're basically claiming Raven Keeper to me at this point. Uh, or Goon. It's true. I'm just gonna put Goon on you. That'll be, that sounds more fun. That's fine. Uh, would you, uh, would you like to, uh, you, you should gamble me as the Goon. I will do that, then you'll be good. Yeah, exactly. Well, wait, is that how that works? Is that how Art's running it? What do you mean? Uh, if you Goon me, oh no, you, yeah, you do, you would, never mind. Uh, I mean, a Poisoner could hit you first, but otherwise it would keep you yeah. Okay. Uh, I might right. be the gambler. Though. I may or may not be the gambler. Would you like to narrow it down a little bit? I'm not the gambler. I'll take that. Uh, we should reconvene tomorrow. Okay. Bye. Me. Hey, look who's here. Greta. Yeah. Hello, Buck. Would you like to chat? I would love to. I would like to talk to you. Hello. Hello. Uh... Would you like to know if you are my marionette? Uh, my policy is I never want to know. Roger that. <laughs> uh, no. Hopefully I'm not your marionette, and you're just talking shit. That might be the case. Um, what would you like to do then? I will tell you that I am either the courtier who decided to drunk the goon knight one, the raven keeper, or the general who got neutral. I'm going to put you down as general. I'm going to put you down as general. You are free to do that. Um, I will tell you that I have not woken yet as part of my ability. Okay. I can, you know, I'll narrow it down even further than that. Uh, I am a role that I am a role that may or may not affect the game at night on any given night. I have no control over it. Okay. Does that make sense? A long ass custom reminder token. Why don't you just narrow it down? Let's just say I am either the gossip or the f raven keeper or the goon or the moonchild. Okay, you're gossip, raven keeper, or goon is what you're saying. Or the moonchild. Okay, that's fair. Uh, okay. Uh, just sure you don't want to know you're my marionette. I never want to know if I'm the marionette. This is this is like. I, everybody knows this, and if somebody tries to tell me I'm the marionette, I don't believe them because I tell everyone I don't want to know. Okay, then I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, bye. Bye. May I speak with Malachan? Yes, you may. Hello. Hello. How are you? Pretty good. How are you? I'm pretty good. Um, what would you like to do? Um, twos. Okay. Uh, I am either the Raven Keeper or the Virgin. Ooh, I am either the Gossip or the Courtier. If you were the Courtier, did you use it? Let's say yes. What did you pick? A uh, Psychopath. Oh, that's spicy. I like that. Wait, that actually just seems like the most optimal play possible. Yeah, it's kind of fun. Or maybe I'm lying and I didn't use it. Yeah. All right. Um, I will tell you that I am... You know, I'll... I'll uh... I'm going to I'm going to knock down one more. I'm going to knock down one more, okay? Mm -hmm. I may be lying to you. <laughs> why why is that not shocking to me? Uh it's almost like I never tell the truth on day one. <laughs> I might be lying to you in some degree as well. Sweet. I love it. Um okay. Uh what what is your take so far? Do you have any interesting info to share that's not about you? Um, there's a lot, there's a lot of people claiming Cartier and Ravenkeeper, which is probably not surprising, but, um. I mean, sure, that makes sense. Yeah. As um, in, yeah, as in, don't, don't kill me. Yep. Yeah. Or kill me, I guess. Or kill me. Um, possible bloonist out there. Um, I've, I've also heard of a bloonist. Cool. 
Um, Navian's Navian's being Navian. Suspicious sure. already. I love it. I'll uh, I'll go and talk to Navian and see if I can suss out some info. Sounds good. Uh, an amazing voice. I Goose. don't want stories then. Thank you, Bambi. They didn't hear me. Hello. Hello. Uh, what would you like to do? I am happy to give you whatever you give me. I'll tell you I'm the seamstress. Okay. Uh, did you use your ability? Yes. Uh, did you get a yes or a no? I got a yes. Nice. I will uh, not elaborate any further. Perfectly fine. I wouldn't expect you to. I'm the philosopher. Guess what I did? You turned into the seamstress? No. You turned into the goon? <laughs> okay. Um, that's fine. Um, did you turn evil? No, not yet. Would you like to turn evil? You know the answer to that is yes. I think it can be arranged. Ooh. I'll, uh, I'll, 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 I'll holla at my boys and we'll, we'll get in touch. My people will talk to okay. your people. Okay. Uh, by that, you mean your people will talk directly to me because that's how I get turned. Yes. Correct. Yes. Excellent. Thank you. Yep. Sure can. I have not heard a single double claim yet from my okay. end. That I have heard like <laughs> exclusively double claims. I would also like to point out How that is this I <laughs> I've been only doing like threes or twos with people, so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm hearing those things a lot, but they're not all hard claims. Yeah, I guess they're mostly in twos for me as well. Right. Welcome back, everybody. Would you like uh, gossips in chat or verbally? Um, I would like them verbally so that. Uh... Our stream can can get them out loud and not have to strain looking at their screen. May I gossip? Uh, but I will provide a couple minutes for that, and then I will open up nominations. Bruce would like to gossip that both Demeda and Navian are good. As they say in the bear, heard. Uh, Mia would like to gossip that uh, the demon is set between Resnora and Jason inclusive. Which direction? Uh, sorry, the the short direction, <laughs> clockwise. <laughs> 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 Heard. Uh, uh, Simon would like to gossip that there are three outsiders in play. Heard. Uh, Navian uh, will gossip that there are two evils from Malishan through Simon, clockwise inclusive. Malishan through Simon, got it. Heard. Hello, Hello, we'll go go on, Hello, you first. Um, Hello, will gossip that there are. Two outsiders within the top five players in the Grim, being FM Jason through Bambi. Got it heard. Malachan. Malachan would like to gossip uh, that I am either the gossip or the general. Heard. Malachan will gossip that there is a blueness in play and a spirit of ivory minus one. Uh, do you mean sentinel? Sorry, sentinel minus one. Yes. Yeah, I assumed you meant sentinel. <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> One fewer uh, evil player. <laughs> Molobok would like to gossip that Demeda is good boy. Heard. Uh, Avery, FM, J FM, oh, go ahead, Avery. Go ahead. Avery would like to gossip that this is a valid gossip. Go ahead, Jason. <laughs> yeah, I heard that. Uh, FM Jason will gossip that there is a marionette in play. Heard. Lastly, well, not lastly, probably, but Demeda would like to gossip that a once per game ability has already been used. As a, it was used last night, I should say. Heard. Uh, Bambi would like to gossip that someone is drunk by the person master. Heard. All right, we'll leave 30 seconds since all the, a lot of gossips have been done, just in case you want to talk about anything else. Demeda would like to claim Psychopath and pick Navian. Okay. Demeda claims Psychopath, throws the axe at Navian, hits Navian, but it's just, it's just made of plastic. I would like to pick up the axe, claim Psychopath, and hurl that back at Demeda. Navian claims Psychopath, picks up the axe, throws it back at Demeda, and Demeda does not die. Nice playing catch with you, Navian. Yeah, that was fun. We should do it again. <laughs> uh, Molobok will claim Puzzle Drunk Psychopath and target Bambi. <gasps> <laughs> Don't and be uh, nothing happens. Don't be relaxed. Of course, drank with a Psychopath. Poison uh, Psychopaths. And pick Mullibok. Baby picks Mullibok as the psychopath, and nothing Wee! happens. Oh, you poisoned me. Hello would like to claim Bleach hosted psychopath and pick Mia. And Mia remains alive. One day this game, this Post day will. And I will, I will go ahead and open up nominations now as well.
Ekin, thank you for the year. Uh, before nominations, Jason will claim real psychopath and pick Melishon. No. It's you. well, it's too late, but uh nothing happens. Don't do that. <laughs> uh Tomato would like to nominate Tomato. Is that cool? There it is. In a shocking move that we had rarely seen on this server, Tomato has nominated Tomato. Tell us about this nomination. Hashtag branding. Uh, however, I actually am a good player, and I have an ability that is going to be beneficial to town. Um, I just want to get the nomination out of the way so that nobody else can do it, and because I have a brand to uphold. Um, I don't actually want to die. I would really enjoy living, uh, because I want to see if my gossip went off. But uh, you guys can kill me if you want to. It's fine. Okay, uh, Demeta is nominated. Six votes will be needed in order to execute Demeta today. Our brand means death. No, don't kill Demeta. He promised that he could turn me evil as the goon. Yeah, I lied to you, Navian. I've... Oh. I've heard from a little birdie <laughs> that the Cordier drank with the oh. goon, so the goon can't turn really? evil Rez, please put days. down... Oh. Don't oh, no. nominate yourself, Tomato. Six yeah. votes have been achieved. And my hand Tomata... would have stayed down if you didn't say that you'd lied to me. Oh, no. is scheduled it? for execution. Who's this Corsi? I just the goon because I don't believe them. Yeah, I don't believe this. Yeah, I think that's the actual goon. Whoever is claiming that is the goon. It was. Did, it, did Tomato like make an appointment for an execution at 6 30 or something? Apparently. Apparently. Okay. <laughs> Demeda uh, said we have to get this game over. Let's go. I will the provide demon. a <laughs> second call for nominations here. Malishan nominates Bruce. Malishan is nominated Bruce. Malishan, tell us about this. I believe I heard Bruce claiming to be the um, courtier who drank with the goon, and I don't believe that. And Bruce, Bruce your defense to this claim? Uh, well, when I brought that up to Mullabach, Mullabach said uh, that like maybe the poisoner chose stuff? the goon and I'm not actually drunk, and so I'm locking the goon as drunk and evil for three days. <laughs> so that could be fun. <laughs> okay, Demeda is currently ex scaled to be executed for six, so you will need more than six in order to change this, starting now. I sort of trust Bruce. I sort of trust me, too. <laughs> Isn't Bruce confirmed good? Up there. Yeah. What are we I'll doing? I'll, I won't tell you. I will. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> that is seven, and Bruce is now scheduled for execution. Bruce, are you actually okay with this? Nah, well, I mean, not really, but like it's better than a tie. <laughs> okay. Tomato. <laughs> If I, we, if we... I just wanted to get off the block. Avery nominates Avery. Okay. Avery has nominated Avery, or as we call it, pulling a Demeta. Tell us about it, Avery. Um, I'm dying. Tomato. Unlike Demeta, I am okay to die. And I know that that is a death sentence. A lot of people say we shouldn't kill people who are willing to die. I agree. However, I think Bruce is more good than Demeta is. And so instead of killing Bruce just to say Demeda's weird uh, nomming themselves fantasies. Uh, we should just kill me instead, because it's fine. We don't king shame here. Okay, Bruce is scheduled ne with never seven. Never king shamed. So more than seven will be needed to change this to Avery. I, I would I would never king shame Demeda. Did you redeem a beanie coat change? I didn't see it. Oh, you did. I, I so currently sorry. wish that we had left it on Demeda, because I think lifting twice is a little weird. Yeah, I agree. Lifting twice, I just want to be off the block. Well, that is nine, <laughs> and has been changed to Avery. Avery is now scheduled for execution. Can we try to lift again? <laughs> yeah, Jason nominates Jason. <laughs> Jason has nominated Jason. Tell us about it. Uh, I think Avery is probably not as good a kill as me, so we should just kill me instead. Okay, uh, nine for Avery. Ten or more will be needed to change this to Jason. Starting lift, now. Lift, 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 lift. Oh, lift would be great. Let's Come do on, three please. more nominations. No. Come which, on, please. With <laughs> each really lift. <laughs> Come on, please. Please lift this. This would be so good. Oh, sad. Wait, we're... Uh, are we tied? Are Jason, tied? Jason, 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 tied? No. <laughs> are you serious? Was that a tie? No. Yes. It was. That is what? nine and is a tie, so now no one is scheduled to be executed today. All right, great job. Navy nominates Simon. <laughs> Navy and nominates Simon. Tell us about this. Uh, tied it. Sivan, your defense to this? Yeah. <laughs> sure did. 
Currently nine is the top vote. We'll need more than nine to, to schedule seven. I will tie it. Raspberry Pi. No. Raspberry Pi. Raspberry Pi. Not. Damn, this town crier is bad right now. <laughs> Flower we, girl eating we, good tonight. We have <laughs> killed a good player. Eleven Listen, is this, enough. We only did eleven. We can still lift we again. Still <laughs> still <laughs> let's I will provide. I'm not voting again, so I no, will you can't. So uh, we can I will tie provide, again. I'll provide a final call here. I, though I doubt that will be exceeded. I would uh, like to revise my goose sip to be that the demon voted today. Uh, Mia nominates Mia. <laughs> Mia nominates Mia. Tell us about it, Mia. Okay. Not a meme. Sivan gave me a claim that I would like to stay alive. Can we tie it, maybe? Nope. <laughs> tie on 11. I'll vote. It was a nice I'm This isn't my fault anymore. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I, we, we should have killed the Meta. Can we all agree? We I mean, should have. Yeah, yeah, we should have. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Look at what you did, the Meta. <laughs> I didn't vote to listen. This is the Meta's fault. This isn't my fault. Five is not enough, and with yes, that, uh, I'm gonna declare the day finished in three, two, so one. Tonight, Sivan, the town believes you to be on the Eon's evil team. How would you like to be executed today? I want to be fed to the cats. The town has brought forth the offering to the cats who are surrounding the town. The cats, being harbingers to the Eon, are bound to. To do as the Eon says, and one of the rules of the game is the town has the ability to execute. So they fling your body at the cats. The cats rip you to shreds. Sivan, you are executed, and you die. And the game is over? The game is over? <laughs> oh, I wish. Eleven votes on the demon day one. So not, so not and the good loops? night. Oh. Uh, good night. Good night. Alright, so I'm definitely dying tonight. Perfectly fine. I actually think that so here was the plan. The plan. The plan. The plan. The plan. The plan was for me to do that because now everyone is saying that I'm evil. Avery's like, oh, we should have killed Demeta. And Avian's like, no, we should kill Demeta. What does that mean? It is not beneficial for the demon to kill me tonight. They should leave me alive as a potential demon candidate, or at least an evil candidate. Yes, you are correct, Ryback. Yo, that is a zero wing reference. I see you, Chad Rom. I see you. Main screen, turn on. Each night the ST will ask a member of chat to describe the game state in three or less words. You learn the three words. That's pretty good. If I get X, that's fine. I'm going to use the ability tonight. The question is, who do I pick if I don't get killed? If I'm poisoned, I'm poisoned. It's fine. Whatever. Oh, I'm using it tonight. I'm definitely using it tonight. I was hoping a psychopath would come out. Jason seems to have suggested that they may actually be a psychopath, but it's fine. If you get your ability, check Bruce and Molly. I need to prove my suspicions. Why? What is Molly and Bruce? Explain the Molly and Bruce to me. Is it because of the the um the courtier claim? Res and Malachon's too it's too easy. It's too easy. I do think Res might be evil though. Navy and Bambi? Mm. Of course they talk first. They always talk first. Oh my back light isn't mm. Oh well. It's gonna just look a little Blair Witchy in here. Last time it seems to check two evils on night one. I am a demony clam. That's true. It's always strong with confirmation chain behind them. That works whether they're good or evil. Your mileage may vary. That's fair. Could go Avery and Bambi. Mm. I know what I want to do. Navian will just drunk us. Yeah, I, I'm actually willing to believe that Navian really is the goon. I think Bambi and Malachon wouldn't vote on Jason and cause the tie. What do you mean you, at least you see my token? You can see everyone's token. Oh, because of the... Yeah. It's a little weird. A demon bivalve. Shouts to bivalves. I also know that a lot Hello. of people... I'm alive? You are indeed. Is it time for the scissors? It is time for the scissors. Chat and I have been going back and forth about what we like, what we what we want to do. Um, I think... So the, jo the choice is between either Jason and Bambi. Jason seemed to actually suggest that they may really have been the psychopath. I was hoping to save it for one day to actually shave check a psychopath against somebody, but, uh, well, it didn't happen. Um, could also check Sivan against somebody, that's another option too, but I think the most frustrating thing for anybody would be if Bruce and Mullybach could be proven to be on the same team. So, I think the correct play is to choose Mullybach 
and Bruce. You pull out your scissors and you you yearn back to the last set of clothes that you you seemed for Bruce and Mullabach. You remember the fabric choices, the styles, and in your mind, you it becomes clear to you that yes, they in fact do like the same things. They are on the same team. Excellent. Thank you very much. All right. Good luck. Thank you. Ryback, why? Why do you think that? I am going to go to Navian tomorrow and be like, hey, 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 so you're evil, right? Good morning, everyone. As you arise this day and begin a new day of playing the game, you realize now that there is someone no longer here, no longer playing the game. However, before we arrive there, there is a visit from our friend. Abyssinian Berman. Abyssinian tells you, as part of my role in overseeing the game, I have been asked by the Eon to provide you with facts, facts about my race, facts about my group. Fact number one, there is a resort in Anaheim, California named Disneyland. And on that resort, the happiest place on earth, there is a squad of feral cats. They freely roam around the park. They have lived at the Disneyland Forest Resort for decades and are actually used, quite ironically, to help control the rodent population within the park. It is also my duty to tell you I also heard that. that Mia and Avery died Ooh. in the night. Oh, interesting. We have eight minutes. Uh, spicy. Mia chat. Yeah, I would like to chat. Avery chat? <laughs> sure. I mean, it's Avery just not coming. Avery, what happened? I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hey, yo. Hey, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Sorry, I had to get back to the Discord. <laughs> is, it, is, that, is that usually how it ends? Yeah, and he goes, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. <laughs> I'm a great lay. Anyways, that's beside the point. Um, What's up? Uh, You're dead, and I kind of trust you because you're dead. Yeah. What would you like to share? Um, if you are good, we should I'm probably good. look at your neighbors. Why is that? Um, let's just say I am the fortune teller, and I got a yes on you and Bruce, and a yes on you and Resnora. So if you're good, we should be looking. Either you are my red herring, which I don't think so, um, or we should be looking at your neighbors, because one of them is a red herring and one of them is my demon. I mean, I'd love to kill both of them. Well, I only need to kill one of them. Okay. Um, I will take your fortune teller information, and I will put that into the brain processor, and hopefully I can find some use of it. Ye old supercomputer. Indeed. Uh, Which is just I... the meat being electrocuted a bunch. I'll tell you I'm the Raven Keeper, so. Nice. So we should we should have killed you yesterday. Okay. Thanks, love. Yep. <laughs> Uh, may I speak with Hallow? Sure. Hello. Hello? Hello. What are you down for? How about a two? All right. Uh, I am the seamstress. My friend. That's a one. Yep. I decided at the end that I just wanted to give you a one. Okay. I'm the fortune teller. That's a double claim. Cool. I'll give you. I I'll give you. A, I'll give you a that. spicy one. It's a double claim with a dead player. Ooh, fun. Uh, well, you who, can take it did, with a grain of salt. Who did you fortune tell? Um, neighbors, night one moved along. Night two, no, both times. So you got no red herring or demon between Avery me. Sorry, I was just on push to talk. I'm dumb. So you got no. You got no red herring or demon on Avery, Mia, Bambi, or Navian. Seems that way. But Unless you I was poisoned. Navian along with Avery. Yep. Okay. Uh, okay. I uh, still haven't used my seamstress ability yet, so... Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. Block is evil. Interesting. May, I, may I put Mully Bach on the block? Can we talk uh, Avery? Tomorrow. Yeah, sure, Mully Bach. Let's go. Wow, rude. Yeah, the two people I was like, I haven't talked to them yet. 
Hey, Rez, can we follow up from yesterday? Sure. Hello. Hello. So I may have lied to you yesterday. <laughs> yeah? Uh, I am the Moonchild. Okay. So, who do you think I should pick if I die? Because I'm probably going to die. Jason. Why Jason? Because I think Jason might actually be the psychopath. Interesting. Okay. And Jason let it tie rather than putting it on himself. Seemed pretty evil. So, considering considering those things, I think Jason is the kill for today. Okay. If not you. And if it is you, pick Jason. Uh why would I why would I do that? Why why would you pick Jason? You said if it was me. Like if you're the kill. Oh, okay, yeah. Then yeah, of course, yeah. Yeah. If we kill you today, pick Jason. If we don't kill you today, we should kill Jason. Bruce and Navian have been talking for a long time. Eh, not that long. Mm, a little sussy. Anyway, uh, okay. I uh, don't want to moonchild anybody, but we'll we'll pick Jason if we need to. Goodbye. Okay, right. Bye. May I speak with a Bambi? A potate? Oui. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Uh, I am the seamstress. You're the seamstress. See. Si. Okay. Or we, 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 we. What's uh, your information? I picked you and Jason. So you got a yes? None. I'm. I'm no. I'm good. So. Well, there you go. Yeah. So I don't know if you if you're sober or but I trust Jason. I think he's good. Oh, or maybe he just lie to me and he pose on me every night. That would be unfortunate. Uh, uh, that's because, just uh, that's what I got. Yeah. Okay. We'll see. Or maybe you're just a marionette of Bruce. I might also be a marionette. That is true. Uh, uh, would you like I to have, share? Um, I know someone who got a yes on you as a fortune teller. So you could be just a red ring. Or I have heard that as well. Yes. Yeah. You could be the red ring or maybe the, the fortune teller is poison. Uh, I could believe both of those things. Yeah. Okay. But you know, if you want to kill me, I'm, I'm fine. So it will be not good for the town, but yeah. What are you? I am the fortune teller. That's a triple claim. Nah, but who, who's who stole my wall? Avery and Hollow. Yeah, but Avery, if Avery, she's lying. She's not the fortune teller. Sure. I'm in a swap with someone, so if she she made a permission, I can tell you. The the only yes that I have, it's between Jason and you. Well, I'm a seamstress that's spent. I'm happy to die today. Okay, that's fine. Okay. You could you could be just my weathering. That's a possibility. Absolutely. Merci. No, I think Hart will do this. Thank you. Bye-bye. Ooh, Art about to break out the dragon. <gasps> Me lying? Sure. Thank you. Wow. Everybody, the dragon has appeared and disappeared. It's very funny to be messy. Um, I will give you a few seconds to talk. Gossip, do whatever you want to do. So, a little bit of pertinent info for town. I was the gambler, and I gambled on someone and I died. <laughs> so, uh, do you think that they're worth killing into? Uh, maybe not today. And I kind of want to keep the person on the DL in case they get, in case they eat a real kill. It was pointed out to me today that this could actually be a po charge with two deaths on the script, which is terrifying. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh, no. Wow. Uh, Demato would like to claim Psychopath and target Navian. <gasps> Demato once again claims that he is a Psychopath, runs across to strike Navian, but uh, re reconsiders at the last moment and just doesn't, and nothing happens. I would like to claim Psychopath, but not target Demato. I'm just going to give him a hug since he ran all the way over here. Navian too, reaches out and graves, gives Demeta the most psychopathic hug, but Demeta survives. That's all their hugs. A psychopathic hug is the name of my new wrestling furniture. <laughs> Bruce would like to gossip that one of Mullabach and Malishan are evil. Heard. Avery would like to gossip that Demeta, Bambi, and Malishan is the exact evil team. Heard. Thanks, Avery. You're dead. <laughs> Reznor would either? like to gossip that at least one of Puzzle Master, Cordier, and Gossip are in play. At least one of Puzzle Master, Cordier, and what? Gossip. And Gossip. Okay, got it. Thank you. Demeta would like to gossip that exactly Fortune Teller, Puzzle Master, 
and Snake Charmer are in play. Heard. Navian will gossip that Snake Charmer is a demon bluff. Heard. Okay. With no further gossips, I will open up nominations. Um, Hallow will gossip that there are once per game abilities which have not yet been used. Heard. Can Demeter anyone like nominate, nominate Demeter? De 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 cool, great. Is that Demeter <laughs> nominating Demeter? You're... Tell us about this, Demeta. Um, I would like to get exactly five on this, if at all possible. Um, also, be messy in chat gossips that, wait, is that Grim Scenarios, a weekly pod? I'm not going to do the whole thing. Anyway, exact, exactly five would be great, though. Okay, five votes game two. will be needed. Starting now. Yeah, I was going to say, they're, they're storytelling game two. This is shilling for no reason. I'm a big shill. <laughs> you sh you should go no to reason. you should go to Las Vegas and watch Grim Scenarios live. Fine. For your request, I'm putting your hand my hand down. But if we get you off the block today, I'm gonna be real cross. Let's Thanks. keep getting the minute. That is exactly <laughs> five. Demeta is scheduled to be executed. Bambi nominates Bruce. Bambi nominates Bruce. Tell us about this. I'd like to save uh, my demon, Demeta. Please. Merci. Bruce, your defense. Uh, well, this is only the second day of the goon being drunk by me, so you can kill me tomorrow. Hey, Demet is on the block at five. Six will be needed to change that. Listen, you guys all heard Bruce. We gotta keep getting Demeta off. Let's keep getting it. <laughs> Juice Save. that tomato. I'll, I'll lend my hand to the tomato. Save tomato. Juice that tomato. I really appreciate no. that it needs this many hands to get me off. Apparently, well, it takes goo? apparently it takes more than two to get Demeta off. He is still scheduled to be executed. Uh, Molobach nominates Navian. Molobach is nominated Navian. Tell us about this. Uh, one, I also want to save Bambi's demon, and two, Navian did not participate in getting Demeta off. I thought I'd give them another chance. Navian, your defense. Bring shit out of here. Uh, so we're getting Demeta off by getting you, no, getting me on. Um. No, I don't like that. I believe we would be getting Demeta off to turn you on. Nope, nope, don't like but that. There you go. <laughs> Let's do it. No, you, you made no. this bad, Demeta. All in. <laughs> y'all started this. Y'all have to sit with it. Maybe we requested this a lot, and we should not do this without this. permission. The consent. That's matters. right. Consent is very important here. Yes. Yes. yes consent because if is we sexy. always waited for consent, we would definitely always kill the D every single time. Three oh, is not demons? enough. Tomato on the block. I'm going to say we're going to close this in 10 if I don't have any further nominations. Did not know we were talking about demons. In 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Tomato, the town has determined that you are in fact the culprit of this game. How would you like to be executed? While getting off. Well. Good luck. Tomato is renowned in this town for doing one thing. Getting on. But today, today is the day that he decides beyond all days that he is going to, in fact, get off. And get off he does as he leaps off his horse and off the side of the cliff where he is executed and dies. And I'd like to congratulate Demeta for finally getting off. The game continues. Not into horses, just FYI. All right. So. What have we learned, chat? So, Navian is definitely playing evil. I don't know if I trust this... I don't know if I trust this... Uh, uh, oh, I did lie to Rez. Oops. Classic CT is right, Sin. I did indeed lie to Rez. <laughs> Not into horses. Uh, Hallow is... Uh, or, sorry, uh, Bruce. I did lie to Bruce, I believe. Did I tell anyone I was... I told someone I was the seamstress, but I just gave them the wrong information. I know I told Bambi I was the seamstress... I think I might have told Molly Baka was the seamstress. I think some heat should be put on Rez. Yeah. I did tell Nate. Did I tell Navian? I didn't even. I didn't even chat. With, oh, I did chat with Navian. No, I told Navian that I was going to turn them evil. I told Bruce Snake Charmer. Uh, chat just reminded me what I claimed to you, Bruce. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I don't need to know. Demathrin the Great? No. See, here's the thing, guys. So, I. That that's that's treading eerily close to 
uh, being considered a mathematician. All right? And we all know mathematician is just a strictly worse snake charmer. I'm not into that. All right? I'm not into it. I'm willing to believe that both Bruce and Mollybach are evil at this point. I can tell you the math's a roll. I can tell you that it's just a worse... It, do, it does the job of a snake charmer, but worse. Tell chat, wait. Is that Grim Scenarios? Johnny Katz, thank you for the 10 months. We appreciate that. I'm buying into DJ's evil team? That it's Bruce and Molly? I'm fine killing Rez, too. I'm fine killing everybody. But I only have one vote, so I gotta... I gotta make it, uh, gotta make it count. I love all the shilling for... Grim scenarios, though. I should probably do it for posterity since we're going to be in here in night phase for a little while. So you guys can just have this available. Wait, is that Grim Scenarios? A weekly podcast hosted by wonderful people Milk and Emma that drops every Wednesday in video form on YouTube and in audio form on your favorite podcast app? A podcast about various scenarios a player may find themselves in, showcasing strategies that they would use in said scenarios to best optimize their chances of winning? Go visit them on YouTube and your RSS feed. Uh, it does solve butt memes. Butt memes. Butt memes. That's good. Good Sanders, morning, good. town. As you gather around to see what happened during the night, you are once again visited by Abyssinian Berman, and he has another wonderful fact for you the wealthiest cat in the world blackie had a fortune of seven million pounds which was about 12 and a half million in u.s dollars when blackie's millionaire owner passed away the owner refused to acknowledge any human family members in his will and instead gifted his massive fortune to his last surviving cat now that that's a lucky cat in other news fm jason and bruce died the night Fuck! Oh, oh Bruce! Oh, hold on, everyone, everyone. I would like to claim Moonchild, and I will pick Malachon. Heard. So, yeah, five, five minutes. So, are we still living in the world where uh, there was double kills, uh, and it's just a Poe being sneaky, or are we going to miss the shot now? Uh, yeah, so, sure. I tried to drunk the Poe, so I don't think it's a Poe, unless I'm poisoned. I it's, critical too. it's not It's not a shot. Oh, Rez, the stuff you're doing is just incredibly shabby. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> kind of is, yeah. It's just like, I, hey, yeah. I'm causing an extra kill tonight, and then I'm causing an extra kill tonight. And, but it's not a shab, don't worry. I mean, if you want, I can gossip something that's not true, or you can kill me today. I'm just the gossip. No, I've technically been helping oh, wait, 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 the evil on. team with these gossip. I, I would, on, I would rather you stay yeah. alive and you just got something that's not true. Okay. Yeah. Uh... I would like to know who Mia died in. Me, unfortunately. Yeah. Who is me? Well, Hello. Hello. I so, am very willing to admit that. The thing is, do we believe the res is just going around killing people? Because then two deaths is fine. Yeah, I think it's possible. I think we should have res gossip, whatever res wants to gossip. I personally would like to see either Malishan or Bombi or Bombi day today. Well, Mal's been picked oh. by the Moonshine, yeah. so we can yeah, so... make Malishon alive and wait and see what happens with that. I agree. Yep. It's uh, Moonshine. Hello. Hello. Uh, weren't you claiming courtier? I, I was, yes. But you're not. But I'm not, yes. Okay. Uh, so I'm the seamstress, and I picked you and Brez, and I got a no. That's when did you do that? Night two. Uh. Why? Screw it. <laughs> I'm the goon. I thought uh, the, 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 the Navian was the goon. Navian's claiming goon. You're the goon. Are you good? I think good all game. I'm very sad. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know if I trust that. Well, I'm going to die tonight. And then I'll be proved that I'm good. But it, it'll prove I'm good right now. If evil picks me before the Moonchild goes, I could turn and then die. But Ah, oh, right. Okay. Okay. That works. Um... So you can execute me if you want, but I, to make sure I'm good, or you can... Take it. I'm not told anybody else I'm the goon. I've been claiming Courtier and Snake Charmer to everybody else. Okay, I'll take that. Um, so, up to you. Alrighty, well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Get it. It's also entirely possible it is a shab game and I was the possible drunk. Okay, here, here's a question, Rose. Do you know if there's info on your waking patterns? Because that would be helpful. I don't know. Okay. May I speak with Malibok? You may. Hello. Greetings. 
All right, so you're saying Courtier picked the Shab? No, I picked Poe. You picked Poe. Okay. Could have been Gambler Death, Gossip Death, Poe Charge. So you could have had like four deaths with Reds' Gossip. So what's your take on Navian? I don't know. Their information on me checked out, but it could be a lucky guess. They're claiming information. Yeah. They did to me. They did not claim that to me. Um, did they claim Goon to you? Yeah. Okay, well, they could have been lying to me, hoping I was evil and would flip them evil. I don't know. Well, I've already heard of another goon. That's the weird part. Okay. Navian didn't claim goon to me. Philo who's, goon. Who's, philo goon? Philo goon. Well, Navian would do that, to be fair. Navian would do that. I have some information that I think might be pertinent to you, though. Tell me. I am the seamstress. Oh, what do you got? You and Bruce. Yes. Oh, that's good news. I thought it might be. I think that makes Malachal look pretty bad, but I guess they're being Moonchild picked. So we stay away from them. Do we just kill Rez? Uh, we could kill Rez. There might be info on Bambi. Some people want to kill Bambi. I'm not sure what it is. I don't know too much about Bambi this game. Bambi could I, I think... be a fortune teller that has a yes on me. I mean, I think I'd... I kind of want to kill a fortune teller at this point in the game. Fortune teller is very suspicious. I agree with that. And they live. Rez is either the gossip or the Shabaloth. I think those are both very likely scenarios, yes. I'm not sure which. We can find out. But we can find out. We can always kill her, but gosh. I think do you know any other yet? And Justin welcome and I... back, everybody. Uh, Have some time to chat. Can I come clean? I, I agree with what you're saying, and the third I think would be one of Demeda or Simon, probably. Can I can I share my information real quick, please? Um, I am a chef of a zero. Um, I understand that not everyone's worried about Shabloff, but I am a little bit. Um, so I would, I'm not going to tell anyone to do whatever, but Resnora, I would request uh, if you maybe didn't gossip something, gossiping false, really appreciate it. Where I'm sitting, good? It, it would, yeah, we've already decided I'm not going to gossip something true, or if it is true, it won't get a kill. Cool. So where I'm sitting, where I'm sitting right now, is between Hollow and Bambi, there's one evil. Malish on a Mullah book, there's one evil. Um, I tend to lean towards Hollow and Mal uh, Malishan being the two evils, and I would like to kill Hollow today. But based upon my Chef Zero information, Sivan and Demeter are only people we killed. Um, either of them can be evil. I just don't necessarily know if which one of them it is. Uh, yeah. So That's where I'm at. From what I've heard, if I'm evil, I'm evil with Demeter, just for everybody's you could be evil with Sivan. You if, could be. Um, if Molobak is evil, then I think he's probably a leech or a poisoner. Oh, mm -hmm. and also to be, um, to be honest, I'm the puzzle master, and there's a puzzle oh. drunk, and okay, that is um, drunk. That okay, oh. like the puzzle master on other information could also make me evil, I guess. Oh no. The puzzle master could make me puzzle drunk. Yes. Uh, in which case, we're just chasing tails. Oh. Nominations are now open. Um, I would like to gossip. And I would like to gossip that I am the marionette. Heard. Got some bad news for you, Rez. You got the marionette. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Demeta. Uh, Demeta had a secret Scarlet Woman that snuck onto the script. Can someone nominate Rez? That'd be dope. I would like to nominate Hala. Some or have someone else nominate Hala because I'm dead. Yeah, Navian nominates Hala. Navian nominates Hala. Alive. Tell us about this. Uh, so there is a gambler who died gambling Hallow, and I think that we shouldn't just uh, pretend that that's something else. Like, it, it could be something else. It could be the gamble. Uh, it could be some crossover. There's other information that points to Hallow being potentially evil here as well. I don't want to fully out exactly what that information is, though. Hallow, your defense? Um, I am honestly the only reason i'm not okay with dying here is that i'm worried we have a shab and we're going to end up on like three um and not know who the demon is especially if there are three evils alive which i'm not sure there are um but i'm very scared of that um i've been very open with the fact that i was gambled incorrectly and i'm trying to work around that in my solving um my impression right now is um, Bambi's evil, Malishan's evil, and one of Rez and Demeta, or maybe Mullabok. Um, and yeah, I mean, execute me if you think I'm a demon candidate, because um, by all means, I am. 
Okay, three votes will be needed to put hello uh, on the execution block. I, I may be the seamstress, yes. What's your actual information? Oh, I don't like a... that I have four votes on me here. I'm gonna be yeah. real. Yeah. Four votes is enough. Hallow is currently scheduled to be executed. Right, I, I was think that answering means... Jason's question rather than watching the vote go around. Yeah, I think that means that Hallow, if you are able, you're probably more likely a minion. But at this point, I'm not sure if we'd be able to lift it. Uh, Demeta, Demeta told me today that me and Bruce are on the same team. With an active nomination, I'm going to take this to final call. I'm going to give it a 10 second countdown. So Demeta's the puzzle jump then. Hello <laughs> nominates Bambi. Hello nominates Bambi. Tell us about this. Um, this is this is mostly a gut read, but um, my impression of everything right now is that Bambi is the demon. That's going based on what other people have been claiming. Um, specifically that other people who I think are evil gave me maybe slightly less demon-like claims. I don't know, that's not that much to go off of, but um, this is my current read on the Grim. Um, I highly doubt that it's going to get lifted on me, and that's fine. And Bambi, your defense? Um, not evil, not a demon. My information points between Alice Jason, Demeda, no um, Millibok, and Rez. So this is the information that I got. Hello is scheduled with four Alice votes. Said, you will need knows five in order Bambi, to change this to Bambi. And, and, uh, and Navy. Navian, are we on opposite teams again? No, I think we're on the same team this time. Unless you're evil. Two is not enough. Bambi is safe. Hallow is still scheduled to be executed. I don't know why Demeda would be giving information that clears me if he's evil. Uh, he would be evil with you in that world. But sure, I think, from, from I my think perspective. one of Sivan and Demeda is evil, and I think it's more likely to be Sivan yeah. from my perspective. Closing Excellent. today in five. Hello, Malashan Sivan all Four, works just the same as anything three, else. Three, two, one. Hello, the town has found you to be the next likely person to be evil I'm not a fan here. Of the How would you like to be executed? Probation. Um, I will just join my fellow cats and say hi and hang out. The town says you need to go out there with the cats. And you, you do. And the last you see of Hallo is them disappearing in a sea of cats. And then later, you find Hallow's bones as they were executed and died. And the game will continue. Gasp. All right, so Jason picked Molly, or Jason picked Malishon, which is why we didn't kill Malishon. Bruce is an excellent Shabrez. Yeah, we might just lose tonight, Mega. This might just be Molly Bach playing us, and it's actually a Poe. That was a Poe charge? Or it was a pit hag changing the demon into a poe and that was a they wouldn't have killed two though that's way too powerful for evil they wouldn't uh, art wouldn't have done that i don't think yeah i don't like that navian's playing good but it's not actually i don't know oh by the way you guys will notice that we have a new sound we have some updates to the soundboard so we have your standard right it's classic uh, and then someone uploaded the cute honk, which I'm a big fan of, and Navian loves that one. But I also did some additional ones. So we've got the one that I've called the hello honk, which is, sounds like a hello, you know. Uh, and then we've got the hi honk, or the ha honk, which is like, um, and then we've got the rapid fire honk. That's a, that's a good one. Uh, and then lastly, we have the evil honk laugh. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, those are some good honks. Those are some really good honks. My personal favorite is the hello honk. Hello. But yeah, so if you guys want to enjoy those fantastic honks, uh, well, you should be part of our Discord. Join us on Discord so you can have fun with that. Good morning, town. Once again, you are greeted by our friend Abyssinian. Fact number three, the oldest cat to ever live was named Cream Puff. Cream Puff lived to be 38 years and three days old. 
Dream Puff was born on August the 3rd of 1967 and lived till August of 2005 with their owner Crazy. in Austin, Texas. And in other news, Malachan died in the night and Resnora died in the night. Oh. Three mm. players remain. Wow. I hate everything. I love that that doesn't even clear up anything. Well, it clears up the Resnora is the Shab world. Yeah, well, the, that's fair. I was never living in that world, Resnora. And no one's been well, rest. Some people. Not a single person. Because it's not a Shab. Like, I don't, I don't think I was Moon Child picks. But yeah. I believe it was the Moon Child picks. So. Uh, I, can, I, can I say something? Mm -hmm. I am the poison or poisoned Avery night one. Uh, I think it would be great if nobody nominated today. Uh, uh, I agree, Bambi. We should not yeah. be nominating. Boo. Mm -hmm. Boo. I mean, Boo. Balabak, Balabak, you oh. will not be nominating today. Bambi Rouge. I bet not. I'm your phone. Bambi Rouge. Oh. Boo. I'm, the I'm really the marionette. Yes, yes, Bambi. Yes, Bambi. You're not the marionette. Bambi, Come on. Bambi, you should nominate Navy and Bambi. You're not the marionette. You're not the marionette, Bambi. You're not the marionette, Bambi. I don't know. I mean, Bambi. Bambi, I'm not you're lying. Bambi. Bambi. Cat, if you do this, you will lose. My oracle numbers are all zeros. It's you. <laughs> Sorry, hang on. What? <laughs> Cat, you're the freaking marionette. You have been from day one. <laughs> no way. Come on. All of us are evil. I have been mesturned. All of us are evil. We will win this game. Bambi, 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 think about this. Uh, Bambi, you're the fortune teller who got a no on me on night one. So from your perspective, if you're good, I'm not the demon. And if you're evil, I'm the demon. You're my marionette. And you don't nominate me either way. If you want to nominate anybody, like, do it on Molobok. No, you yeah. nominate you oh, nominate okay. Navian and win with good. Yeah, come and, on, Bambi. Hey, nominations, you would with good. nominations no, are in fact. Then what is Sivan? Avery, then what is, who has a chef zero, which is wrong, because Bambi is my marionette. That's mm -hmm. funny, that's funny. Yeah. No, because Sivan's evil. You're not evil, Bambi. The uh, Sivan is, is evil? Not evil. No, Sivan's not, not evil. I am the balloonist <laughs> with shit information. Yep. You have one night of info, and then we killed Woo. you for time. Thank you for Wait, that. That was very convenient. Incredible. Doesn't this make Sivan evil? Because if Sivan were good, yeah. they would lie yeah. to Bambi saying that they were evil so that we could still try to win. Yeah, exactly. Bambi, hey, you know don't listen to this. Don't listen to this. Balloonist, where's the third Bambi. outside? Bambi, Bambi could not be. Sentinel minus one. one. Right. Just okay. like Malachan yes, said. Yeah. Bambi could be the puzzle dunk. Bambi, Bambi's not puzzle drunk. Bambi, why are you certain of that? Bambi, 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 you're puzzle drunk. How could Bambi you be so certain? Okay, everyone, we're talking over each other. But yeah, the that... world where the world where Bambi is good, it would be that Bambi got poisoned on night one and not Avery, and then the third evil is somewhere like Sivan or whatever. It would, would have to be that. Sivan or Demeta. Yes. Yeah, That's the yeah. world. Or I is... guess Hallow, uh, but yeah, I, I needed cool. Hallow to die specifically because I knew that Mal would die to the Moon Child, and then I could kill Rez, and we'd have an all evil final three. That was very, very set up on purpose. What? Did I really gotta... Yeah, I got a Bruce seamstress yes on Molly Bach and Bruce. Team. So That's this is because yeah. you're the puzzle drum. The main I po the no, I poisoned Amada on night two because the Mada really wanted to live a day. All right, so think? so there's a lot of talking going on. And I'm all here for it if you want to continue doing that. However, nominations have been open for a while, and I've heard a couple people say they're not going to nominate. So Bambi, if all you... three live people choose to not nominate, I will close the game out. But only once they hear from all three of you. Bambi, who did you pick night one? I picked Neven, and every I got a no. Night two, I pick FMGs, and in the middle, I got a yes. Night three, Rise and Buddy Buck, I got a yes. And night four, you... And I got a yes. Okay. So from your perspective, like I said, uh, either I'm the demon and you're my marionette, you don't nominate me, or you're good, and on night one, you can't have been poisoned along with Avery, but, like, you're just good and uh, I'm not the demon, so. There is there is the world, baby, just because we're doing it fair here, right? Where you were poisoned night one, not me. They are saying it's me to get you to not nominate Navian. In reality, it's Navy and Mullabuck and literally anyone else. What if you can be a puzzle drunk as well? I asked Bambi specifically if she likes to be told if she is yeah, married I at it. If she had told me no, I wouldn't have told her. That's but she right. told me yes, so I did. Okay. It's all up to you, Bambi. You do what you want. Oh my god. Just... You gotta nominate, Kat. No. no. If you nominate, you have to do it. You're fooling me. Three, what do I do? Two. Uh, nominate. One. Just go. Just, 
Brilliant, I'm going to v sleep. It's okay. Uh, if I've been bamboozled, you play well. I uh, would like to nominate uh, the story terror, please. I'm not joking. <laughs> it's not a bad nomination, baby. All right. If there will be no nominations, I will close the day in 10, but I will count it down unless you tell me not to. She's not Three players that are alive. I mean, I'm not nominating. So. Five, four, for now, so. three, two, one. Town has decided to execute no one today. And I would like to say that the game is in fact over. And sadly for Abyssinian and all the rest of the cats, they will continue to be harbingers from the one beyond because evil has won this game. Congratulations. Good job, evil team. I think you guys have mostly figured it out through uh, evil kind of revealing themselves, but uh, we'll start at the top. Mia is the gambler. Mia did gamble Hallow as their role. However, uh, Mia was uh, picked by the demon that night and was killed by the demon, not by their own ability. Hallow was the Raven Keeper who never received any information. Bambi was the marionette who thought they were the fortune teller and gave out their information uh, already. Uh, Navian was your one and only starting imp. Uh, Navian made some very timely kills. Um, Malachan, I'm not sure anyone knows this Malachan. Malachan was the goon. Uh, Malachan was never picked by anyone until the moon child picked them. Uh, Mullabach was the poisoner. Mullabach poisoned Avery, as stated, uh, then poisoned Demeta on the night Demeta used his ability. And then, I uh, what was the third poison was, oh yeah, was Resnora, right? Uh, Resnora, the gossip, did as much work as Navian did almost this game. Uh, two true gossips, uh, which they have already put in chat. I used the first gossip to kill, uh, A Avery because Avery had gotten information and I felt like it was still a good opportunity for good to gather information. Second kill, I, I really fought myself over there for a while. There weren't a lot of good options. Um, I felt like I'd given Bruce two days and Bruce was the least uh, damaging to town kill at that point. So uh, Bruce was killed by that second gossip. Uh, Demeta was the seamstress, used their ability on night two when they were poisoned uh, to check Bruce and Mullabach, who were in fact not on the same team, but I said they were. Bruce the puzzle master, who I chose uh, to make puzzle drunk Avery at the beginning of the game. Uh, Avery was double poisoned that first night, poisoned and drunk. Uh, so it been, been hard for you to put that together probably anyway. Uh, Sivan the Balloonist, who died early and took a lot of good information with them on the way out, uh, was just given uh, Jason, the outsider, to start. Jason the Moonchild, obviously uh, responsible for killing Malchon. Avery the Chef, who I gave a zero to, as they were both drunk and poisoned. Uh, bluffs were Chambermaid, Courtier, and Philosopher. And that was your game of Whiskers on Kittens. Thank you, you all for playing. Thank you. Thank you, Art. Thank Thanks for writing, Art. It's always Navian. <laughs> every time said. I play with Navian, it's always Navian. It's not my fault that every not time always. I try Chambermaid you know, Bluff, it either works really, really well or really, really poorly, and there's nothing in between. The worst part is Navian. I, I, I said it. I said the words. You did say the I was in that, a, yes. I was in a call in a chat with Navian, and I said, Navian, I'm trusting you. That should probably mean I should want to kill you, because we're never on the same team, and I always trust you when you're the deep. And then, ah.